Next, I have a cream product. I actually am really into cream, so I do have quite a bit of these. But some of them just either aren't working or I don't reach for, so I am going to get rid of some. First of all, I have Benetint. I am not getting rid of this in the summertime. This is one of my favorite ways to kind of rosy up my cheeks and let it be really light makeup. Actually, some things on this. So I am going to keep that one. Next is the blush stick by ColourPop. I'm letting this go. It has to warm up a lot for it to work, and it doesn't really give me that much color. It is this pink, but does not look lightweight in the skin. And it is in the shade, doesn't say, oh wait, here it is, uh, Mini Me. So I'm going to let Mini Me go. It's just not for me. This is Tristique. This is so gorgeous. I'm actually wearing this today. It is just a vibrant pink, but blends. You can use it heavy. You can use it dull. It's just fantastic. Next, I have the Space Case Cosmic Gangster. This is a cream. And this one just is stunning, but it's very light. It's buildable. And it just looks really, really good. I don't know if the camera's even picking that up because it is buildable. There it goes. So it is gorgeous. I am keeping that one. Next, I have three Girlatic. I have Cream Blush in Pink. And I am keeping that. I love Girlatic's formula. I have the Skin Glow. I think we got this in BoxyCharm. It actually was close to a year ago, but it's still in great shape. Then I have Chic, or Chic Shine Starlight Pink. This is a highlighter. So this is great. Keeping that. So now, since I did that highlighter, I'm going to my highlighters next. I have the Milk Makeup. This is the Mars highlighter. I don't care for this. It's one of the few cream milk products I can't stand. Other formula or concealer I don't care for either. This is Lightning Crew. It's by the Beauty Craft. This is actually expired. As is this e.l.f. all over color stick. This is actually like two or three years old. I didn't even know I still had it. I just found it like in the crook of a drawer. And it still smells and works, but I'm not taking chances on a cream product. I have a Jeffree Star Liquid Frost. This, I believe, is in peach something. Frozen peach. This works good. It does come out a little thick. Other than that, it works really good. The Hello Halo by um, Wet n Wild is expired. This one is kind of interesting. It's by Jolie Cosmetics. And you pop the top and then you can pull it out. It's a pretty dark color though, so I am not going to keep it. If you look, it, that's how you get it out. It's kind of neat. Next, I have the Becca All Over Skin Glow Stick. I don't even know if I've used this. I think I've only swatched it. I am going to keep it. It is my shade and it's cream. And it's Becca. Seattle London Dewy Stick. This one just doesn't do it for me. I am going to let it go. And again, I do love Seattle London, but that product was just not for me. This one is Universal Beauty. It's I got this in a glossy box. This one is a little bit hard to work with, but it looks stunning when you get it on, so I am going to keep it. This is the Larizzi Liquid Beam. I just can't get down with this. It feels like oil on my skin. And lastly is the ColourPop Highlighters. This one is in Starbright. Looks like that. I get very little color caps. I'm going to let that go. Next, I, oh, I have one more. I have a blush actually that rolled away. This is from Milk. This is the travel trial size. Does look like this. It's this one right here. And it's gorgeous and I am keeping that. So one I know right off the bat I'm going to get rid of. This is the Milani Con Contour and Highlight. I don't care for this one. It's actually cool, which a lot of them aren't, but I am going to part with it because I have so many and cream go bad so fast. This is the now, I think, discontinued Tarte the Sculptor. This works fantastic. It actually, ooh, look. It's like coming out. Put it back down. This has almost like a bronzy color to it, but it doesn't turn orange on my skin. I have the Hula, and I'm not opening it because Hulas always fall out, so I'm leaving it there. When I those flesh were on sale, I did purchase a darker shade in 25 to use. This is Salted Caramel, and it's to use as a bronzer. I have yet to use it, but since I paid less than $3 for it, I'm really not worried about it. Then I have a Makeup Revolution. This is actually, again, a darker shade that I bought to use as a contour or primer. I don't care for it. I'm going to see if the girls can use it. Lastly, I have my Milk Primer, or Milk Bronzer, excuse me, cream. And if you look, this is so cool to me because I'm not good at using all my makeup. I've almost used it all. It's right at the thing. And I am going to try to use this literally to the bottom. So that is all my cream products. I did not have a ton of... Um, expired which I thought was going to be the case I did have three so we do have three expired products that was the wet and wild the elf and the um beauty crop 
I have quite a few declutters that I'm giving to the girls. I think they'll be happy. They're just starting to figure out cream. And then I am keeping all of these. So that is my cream. Next would be regular bronzers, blush, face palettes, stuff like that. And I'll get those up pretty soon. Thanks, guys.